Okay, I bring you scholarship again from University of uh, Brigham. This university is in in UK. You can see it. It's in UK. It's in UK and it's for those that want to go for MSc in Development Policy and Politics. So if you have a first degree in Political Science, this is an opportunity for you. And this scholarship is with Mo Ibrahim Foundation Internship. So you can see this is an opportunity that you can make use of because even while you go through the master's, you still have opportunity for internship. That means you have opportunity to get work experience. And that is an added advantage for you. So the notion why this scholarship is on is this politics matters you know a lot of us especially um christians they try to shy away from politics but now so many people are now waking up so the notion for this scholarship is that politics matters and and the truth is what you have to become a mantra to develop uh, to the development of a uh, policy makers and practitioners so the MSc makes a direct link between academic and practical policy approaches to development rooted in theory and in evidence. So is um, international development, uh, 20 credits, that's the courses that you're going to take. Eligibility, the entire requirement consists of a first class honors degree or equivalent from approved university is essential. So when you see essential, it is not compulsory. So I don't want, once you see a first class, you will shy away. Essential, not compulsory. So with your 2-1 and a strong statement of intent and CV, you can land this scholarship. That's what I want to you as an, I want to establish. That you are seeing a first class doesn't negate the fact that with a 2-1, you can get this scholarship. What you need with your 2-1 experience, outstanding SOP, that's letter, a statement of intent, you can land this scholarship. And what is this scholarship going to give you? But then understand that you must be an African national, domicile in Africa, in any African country. So Liberia, Ghana, Zimbabwe, Eritrea, uh, Mauritius, Nigeria, Niger, Logo, uh, Togo, Bene wherever you are allowed to apply for this scholarship and this scholarship is going to give you full tuition you can see it i'm not making it up and i will put the link in the description box on my youtube channel if you're watching it on facebook i don't put links on facebook the only link i can put in the comment section is how where you can go and look at your how to write outstanding sop and outstanding cv that's the only link you will see in the comment section and if you have any questions drop it also in the comment section and if you feel like encouraging me with what i'm bringing your way you can give me stars and i'll, I'll appreciate that thank you so full tuition effort to i'm from united kingdom you can imagine <laughs> so they're paying flight tickets full tuition full tuition that means your full school fees will be paid FA to and from United Kingdom, then they will be giving you monthly allowance of 950 pounds for 18 whole months. Then arrival allowance of 950 pounds. That's once you arrive UK, they will give it to you. Then the remaining six months of the internship will be funded directly to the successful candidate by the Mo Ibrahim Foundation. This is amazing. Application must be received through the university online application system by 31st of March. You have all the time to do it. Start now. Start now. If you see the way <laughs> election in Nigeria went, eh? get on your toes and move. Don't limit yourself. The truth is this. You are not paying for this application. You are doing it on your own. The only thing is how you should look out for resources. If you need to pay for someone to review your SOP and all that, do that and get the best together. This, this thing may not cost you up to 80000 to gain it. That's if you pay for anything at all. So you actually need to start now. Application is open till 31st of March. And what you need is to upload a 500-word statement of intent and a CV. 
What a simple application. So once you get these two done, then you will send your application ID number to this Debra Bird. So once you submit, you will get application ID number, you send it to this person, then please include more Ibrahim scholarship in the subject line. So I have taught people want how to write email. So your email title is going to be more Ibrahim scholarship. So that when you're sending the email to Debra Bird, so send it, then do not include any supporting documents in this email. Listing, listing, do not include any supporting document. The only thing you need to application ID number that will be sent to you once you submit your application. Then the subject of the email, that's the topic of the email will be more Ibrahim scholarship. Do not include any document. So write your name and state that you applied for more Ibrahim scholarship. And this is your ID number. Thank you. Simple. Don't attach anything. And you are sending that email to Deborah Bed. When you click this, her email will show up. So when you want to do it, remember to click her email. This it is highlighted in blue here when you go to the website. So you will do that and you submit your application. Remember, this is for masters, master's students, and this is University of Birmingham. Thank you. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> So any questions in the comment section thank you very much and if you, you you can encourage me by liking sharing and inviting your friends thank you very much